everyone. I'd love to introduce you some other face cream today. So I have decanted the product for the face. Now this cream has extraordinary transformative effect on the skin. It really helps to restore a useful glow. It helps to tone and firm. I always invite everyone to take some nice deep breath in with the product because it really helps to enhance the product penetration into the deepest layer of the skin. It's also highly aromatherapeutic as well. So if you like a nice even skin tone, please apply the product not just on the face but behind the ear and down the neck as well and the decolletage as well. So this is a very very important part of achieving a nice and even skin tone. So let's get the crystal friends, rose quartz crystals. We can use them cold or warm if you like. It's a really handy um, sachet pouch to put um, your crystals in and keep it in the fridge. So if you keep it in the fridge, um, you can even take it um, to the office with you and keep it in the fridge there. So when you have a micro moment of awareness, just get the crystals out and do some nice movement. It will really calm and cool the eye area. Helps to restore focus and helps to um, cool and calm the area as well. So we're going to work on the eyebrow area, on the eyebrow, under the eyebrow and under the eye with the crystal medallions. So these points on the eyebrow um, and under the eyebrow, they always come to Samadara. So Samadara points situated just on the corner of the eye, you're rolling your finger in and that's Samadara. So this is the temple, this quite large area. Now Samadara just sits just right in front of that area. So. Let me work on the eyebrow area. This actually helps to ease stress, anxiety, and helps to balance emotions as well. When we work underneath the eye area, that really helps to detoxify and helps to work on the kidney and the liver area as well. So we're going to work on our mouth points all in all. I'm not going to really have to tone firm and assist with um, awakening your own natural healing abilities. So let's get started. I'm going to start with drawing big circles around the eye. So I will do circles in one direction and then I will reverse the directions and this time I'm going to come above the eyebrow. Right. So then I'm going to start sweeping out from the eyebrow and just stepping back and sweeping out from the eyebrow. Now next I'm going to sweep underneath the eyebrow, so I'm going to have the crystals a little bit tilted, semi-tilted and sweep out and starting on Samadara. Stepping back, out, pausing on Samadara point, out and pausing on Samadara. From underneath the eye you can either put the crystals flat slide out and up. So this time if we decide to do this, we're going to have the bulging this um, part pressing into Samadara. And just hold. Stepping back to starting position, sliding down underneath the eye and sliding out and up Samadara and hold. It's good if we can hold the 3 to 5 seconds. It just allows the nerve system to respond. Now we can start moving down underneath as well, a little bit more down, and from this position moving up, so lifting. So we're working on the cheek. Up from underneath the sinus and holding it so 
repeat this three to five times. It's really good if you can make a ritual out of it, maybe in the morning, maybe in the evening, maybe both, it would be amazing. And even if you have like a micro moment at your workplace, or if you watch too much television in the evening, before you go to bed, give a bit of a space between going to bed and turning off your computer, laptop or smartphone. Half an hour to an hour, it's really good. And then you can use these tools as meditation, or you can just, you know, switch off your mind and prepare for the restful sleep. So I wish you a very happy practice. And if you have any questions, just please let us know.